Hi, welcome to your channel, Generous, Gracious and Gamut. I am your host, Dr. Moharam Ghosh, and the video I bought for you today is about an inspirational American, Bill Hast, who is recognized by the Guinness Book of World Records for surviving the most venomous snake bites, over 172 of them. He is credited to have found a cure for polio by using snake venom and he is also credited with saving 21 lives of snake bite victims thanks to his regular self injections of snake venom into his body so that his blood developed antibodies to snake venom and his blood could be used to save lives. I will share more about Bill Hast shortly. Before that, let me share with you a brief about the channel Generous, Gracious and Gallant. I started this channel in May 2020 and in a short span of one year, three months, we have garnered over 591 subscribers and 15,000 views. My mission is to increase the present and coming generations to live by the eternal human principles. What are these eternal human principles? These principles are respect for diversity, respect for womanhood, respect for our parents, honesty, integrity. These values are etched in stone and do not change over time and place. Living by these eternal human principles is the only sure shot way to success in life. I request all those of you who have not yet subscribed to our channel, kindly subscribe to the channel and join our mission. Also, Share these inspirational videos with your friends and family. Encourage them to join our mission too. Towards our goal of encouraging people to live by the eternal human principles, we share with you on your very own YouTube channel, Generous, Gracious and Gallant, stories of mankind at their very best living by these eternal human principles. We have also got a Facebook group and a WhatsApp group whose link are given in the description and there we share daily inspiration with all of you. Please join our mission, subscribe to the YouTube channel and make a difference to society. Coming back to our inspirational American, Bill Hast, the American snake ha handler who was bitten over 172 times by venomous snakes and is recognized by the Guinness Book of World Records. He is also credited to have found a cure for polio before the invention of the polio vaccine using cobra snake venom and was responsible in his lifetime for saving 21 snake bite victims, the furthest being a young boy in Venezuela who was bitten by a tropical coral snake and thanks to saving his life, Bill Hast became a honorary citizen of Venezuela. He worked on discovery of prior to the polio vaccine on curing polio victims and is credited to have cured of quite a few polio victims using cobra venom. Born on 30th December 1910 at Patterson, New Jersey, he was interested in snakes from a very young age. He came in close contact with snakes in a Boy Scout summer camp at the young age of 11 years where he tried catching a small timber rattlesnake, he was bitten. He made an X mark over the bite 
and attack applied potassium pomegranate sorry potassium permanganate over the bite and walked 4 miles to his to the camp first aid office he was referred to a doctor but recovered without any further medication the same year he tried to catch hold of a 4 foot copper head a very deadly snake got bitten by that his friend gave him the anti venom injection and he was hospitalized for a week he started collecting snakes and extracting venom from them at the young age of 15 at 19 years he joined a man who had a roadside snake show went to florida and became proficient in capturing snakes at 19 years he thereafter joined pan american airlines as a flight engineer and continued his passion of connecting snakes by traveling across the globe to south america africa and india he started bringing in snakes from there he said there was no laws prohibiting that at that point of time but the crew members did not appreciate it 1947 he opened a serpentium at Miami. 1950, he had been bitten by the cobras 20 times. And 1949, he was supplying snake venom to the University of Miami in the research of treatment of polio using snake venom. He is credited along with the University of Miami of saving many victims of pure polio who recovered thanks to his treatment. However, by 1955, the SAC polio vaccine had come in and the research was halted on using of cobra venom on polio victims. By 1962, he had been bitten by his pet king cobra snake and also by a green mamba by 1965 he had over 500 snakes in his serpentarium and he kept them in 400 cages cages and three large pits he used to extract venom from them between 70 to 100 times a day he at the same period also started experimenting by injecting small enum amounts of snake venom into himself and he did this in increasing quantities to develop antibodies in, in his blood. Thanks to this experiment, he was credited with saving 20 lives of snake victim bites. Like I said earlier, his 21st life which he saved was of a young boy in Venezuela who got bitten by a tropical coral snake and Bill Hast traveled to Venezuela, saved the boy's life and became a friend of the young boy. He also got a honorary citizenship of Venezuela thanks to this act of saving the young boy's life. In 1977, a child on 3rd September, sitting outside a crocodile pit, fell into the pit. A crocodile which had been in the serpentarium for over 20 years jumped on the child and snatched it. The child's father and another man, Nicholas, jumped into the pit but could not save the child as he was battered and drowned by the crocodile. Bill Hast was badly shaken by this incident. Though the child's father did not blame the serpentarium or Bill Hast for the incident, Bill shot the crocodile nine times and despite that, 
the crocodile took over an hour to die. He closed the Serpentarium in 1977 post this incident. He lived to be a hundred years old and died on 15 June 2011. Friends, Bill Hast, an inspirational American who devoted his life to the research of snakes and their venom, is credited to have saved 21 li- lives in the course of his research. He is also credited with having found a cure for polio and cured many polio victims using cobra snake venom along with the University of Miami researchers. He is also recognized by the Guinness Book of World Records as the man who has survived the maximum number of venomous snake bites, 172. However, Bill Hast did not count number of times he got minor bites. He counted only the major bites which injected major amount of venom into his body. He credited his having living for the ripe old age of 100 years thanks to the snake venom which he injected into his body. Friends, Bill has a totally inspirational human being who made a difference to the lives of people around him. Friends, I am sure you love these inspirational stories which I bring for you on a regular basis on your very own channel, Generous, Gracious and Gallant. I request you once again kindly subscribe to the channel and also share these videos with your friends and family. Encourage them to also subscribe to the channel. Please join our mission of encouraging the present and coming generations to live by the eternal human principles such as respect for our elders, respect for diversity and womanhood, honesty and integrity. Living by these principles is the only sure shot way to success. I will be back again with another very inspirational video on your very own channel, Generous, Gracious and Gallant. Till then, good luck, all the best, stay safe.